we can learn today about the session and session management in Salesforce. You go to setup. And type session. Uh, this is session management and this is se session settings. If you go here, session management, you can see the sessions occurred in the past. Um, uh, you can see session types. Um, or a user type, login type, created, updated, valid until, so forth. Um, source, you can see also source IP. Uh, this is a DevOps, so I'm using, um, it has my IP address. This is a username over here. In the session management, you can see the all the user sessions. You can, important thing is in the session settings here, you can set the session settings. Uh, you can time out the session. Currently it's two hours for that. I'll put it eight hours. Um, a disable session timeout warning pop up. Uh, we don't want to pop in, just uh, force logout on session timeout. If you are in the middle of the time uh, update, if the session expired, uh, it forces uh the user to log out these are the session setting log accession to the ip address which originated and then um so uh i have two and three on this is the uh, http attributes this is a uh, extended use of i11 and lighting experience it's kind of obsolete there's none here. Uh, you can. So this is caching. It's enable caching. It's about options about caching. Um, I have a, a uncheck remember me until log out. So this is out of the box settings for me. Enable user switching, enable secure persistent browser caching improve performance. Enable content delivery network, DCDN for lighting component framework. This is for performance. CDN is a content delivery network for caching at that local uh, delivery uh, areas uh, closer to you for lighting component um, in, in uh, performance. Identity verification. This section is about identity verification. Um, yeah, so you can read everything. I'm not going to read it. This one is lightning login. I have check allow lightning login. Uh, this is clickjack protection. It is a cyber security. Uh, clickjack means if somebody is hijacking the clicking. Here I have enable clickjack protection for setup pages. Enable clickjack protection for non setup Salesforce pages. Um, I have. Uh, unchecked for visual source uh, visual force pages yeah trusted domain for inline frames so it is about this you can add the domain trusted domains this is, this is about cross site request forgery protection cross site request forgery is a cyber security um, attack csfr by default both are enabled um, after that, we have content security policy protection. I have check enable strict content security key. Uh, you can click the information. Uh, you can read the information. Lightning Locker API version. Lightning Locker is a security. Uh, is a is a namespace for protection. Um, uh, JavaScript protection. Lightning Web Security is right now. I am. It is uh, disable. Is a new security architecture instead of Lightning Locker to protect Lightning Web Component. It's a pretty new here feature. Uh, older one is Lightning Locker here. It is enabled here by default. 
This is excess test production, cross-site uh, scrutiny production, content sniffing, sniffing also enable content sniffing, but sniffing is a, um, a, as it says, like a sniffing, uh, like a dog. Um, so, yeah. so bad guy sniffing activities, prefer URL production, redirections, the here users warn outside uh, before they are redirected outside Salesforce. These are the session security level. I have multi-factor authentication on logout pages. Uh, if I want to log out, uh, it goes to this. Uh, right now it is uh, blank. I don't want to go there. But in commercial sites, you can see that. Yeah. Store the redirected logout to your access your local browser. So yeah, um, uh, yeah, it's un it's unchecked. New user email. If you send a user email to activation, it expires right now in seven days. Sometimes it's one day. I check it one day. You know, usually it's one day in commercial and government sites. So I can save it. These are the Salesforce session setting. A very important thing is about security and cyber security about the organization. Uh, 